wonderful people. Welcome to my channel, Quietly Be Debt Free. I'm Wanda. And today we're upstairs in my house in my son's bathroom, budget in the bathroom. So go ahead, wonderful people, get your bills together so we can do a budget in the bath. I've got Pink Squeak and Pinky D. My pens. I want to show you where we're at so far with our savings challenge. Here's that bank that I got from the Dollar Tree where you can get any jar. Get a jar, get anything you want. Get a piggy bank, whatever. And put your coins in there and fill it up. Whatever, whatever container you choose, fill it up so you can see how much money you can save. So coins or your change into a jar or into some kind of container so that you can see how much you can save. Get your bills. Here are my bills. Everything's already here. Electric bill, car insurance, everything's here. This is the notebook I was telling you about. Just get a spiral notebook. That way everything is all together. You have everything all together when you're doing your budget. You can look back and you can see where your money went. I was talking to some people and they were telling me about how they have been doing budgets for years. And I was just so impressed because I didn't get started until I was in my 50s. So if you are 20 or 30 and you're doing a budget, you're doing great. You're doing a fantastic job. I want you to have a budget because it's so important when you want to save money, make money, and be debt free. This is how I got out of debt. This is how I paid off $38,980.16 from having a budget. So I want you to do the same thing. What I did was I listed, I listed the two paydays that I'll have in this month. So I always start and I always tell you to start on the day that you get paid. That is going to be the first day of your budget. So I listed the date right here. And then I also listed everything according to when it's due in this pay period. I have some funds that I also save for. And you might want to think about that too. Because have you ever gotten to... Christmas or summer vacation and you say, oh man, oh man, I didn't save any money. I just didn't think about it. I didn't think it was going to get here so fast. So go ahead now and start saving. Start saving for the holidays. Start saving for birthday gifts, for, for just all types of things that you're going to have to pay extra money for. Think about what you want to do. Do you need a new used car? Do you want to save for a new used car? So think about all those things. I listed everything here so that you can see an actual budget that I really truly use. So everything is listed and the amount that I pay for this particular time. Everything, some things fluctuate, but you can see this is a real budget. I took an envelope out of where you can send in the payment I usually do things online, but I wanted you to see how I just use this. It's like recycling. I recycle the envelope that was in there and I use it to calculate how much money all of these things will cost so that I will know how much money, how much extra money I have that I can allocate to the sinking funds or these other funds that I have. Don't forget, I told you in another video about how I have free checking accounts and I have free savings account. They're online accounts. So check out the video about the free savings accounts and checking accounts. This is it. This is the budget in the bathroom. Everything's all listed here. And then everything is listed here up until the next pay day. So this is where the next pay day will start right here. So I went ahead because I have the same things coming out at the beginning of each pay, pay period. Everything is always the same. Tithes and giving, 
food and fun, savings, car insurance, or actually car gas, gas for the car. And so I listed everything according to when it's due. That way, you are sure to pay everything on time. And you also can see how much money you have left over that you can allocate to different sinking funds or different funds. Here's the dry erase board. If a dry erase board works for you, you can use that. And then you can erase things as they come out. But this is with the dry erase board. So I just put everything in here. The same things that are here are on here. I just made it on this so you can see it better. So this way you can see everything better. But the main thing is to look and see when your payday is. And then start from there listing everything that you pay. And then you calculate it and then see how much everything totals. And then whatever you have left over, you can allocate to all of these different funds. Or you can add things here or take away things here. So this is the budget, the budget in the bathroom. As I always say, let's make footprints in this world and build a wealthy debt free legacy. I'm Wanda. Leave me some comments. Let me know how your budget is going. Let me know what you think about this budget. And subscribe to my channel. Bye. Thank you for watching.